Welcome to another episode of C10's Garage. So RJ's back in business. We got the racks back from the powder coater today. So in another thread, I've actually extensively taken apart the Southwest Motec racks and narrowed everything even more on the bike to make it more slipstream, also to save additional weight. I got rid of all the quick fasteners. Um, the system is still held on with two bolts. We did some modifications to the subframe if we need it in the future. I actually took a hint from Modus Motorcycles and um, on their brand they use the same Gibby V35 bags but they made their own brackets incorporated in this rack right here and a single loop that came down off the subframe with a single bag support right here. Um, this is actually welded to the subframe and that's a titanium bolt. If I need some additional support, I'll place a titanium bracket out and down to here. But as of right now, it's not looking like that is going to be necessary. I want to show you guys how slipstream it is. You're looking at the dead front of the bike, pretty even. And you can see the bags are almost not even noticeable to the bodywork. A little bit to the side here, a little bit to the side there. I'm really, really happy with how all this turned out. Of course, everything is put together with titanium fasteners. Uh, badge from my friend. Expensive, lightweight shit. Yeah. You guys see this side. And it just turned out really nice. Show you under the seat. More titanium hardware, hollow titanium hardware at that. Uh, custom billet aluminum pieces to replace the steel spacers that were here uh, some people may ask you know you know the bike's pretty heavy like this well uh, everything that's been put into RJ this bike is still with bags on uh, sub 520 pounds uh, the way you're looking at it right now probably around 519 uh, if I take the bags and racks off it's right around 501 at the latest calculations it weighed 504 earlier in the year on the crane scale with a full tank of fuel and the tour seat. So, hope you guys enjoy. I'll get this up.